doing another giveaway episode opening up 18 packs once again temporal force uh, temporal forces paradox rift one of these days we'll be able to talk let's get into it giving away the mela salvatore iron boulder and i'm gonna throw in one other uh, full art I haven't decided yet on what that's gonna be but it's gonna be a surprise to whoever wins um maybe pretty decent um i haven't really decided yet just haven't gone through them all been kind of rushed still um weird time of the year still with a bunch of sports and stuff for the kids so uh jason vt you are up first we are at temporal forces and we are running six people i believe on this one one two three four five six we got six people all right looking on temporal for Probably the Gengar. Oh, but we have a walking wake off the get-go. Nice. So Jason on the board with the walking wake. And then we got Jim here. Paradox Rift. Paradox, I think we're looking for... My personal chance with the Altaria, but I think the Roaring Moon would probably be the one we want to get. If we can get one... Um, we may not be able to get one just because of us already pulling one out of here. So either that or the... Uh, I can't remember what the other one would be. I mean, maybe the Groudon again? Counter Catcher, that's a solid card. Earth and Vessel, Reverse, solid card. The Oxus and Iron Hands EX, that is solid. Iron Hands is a solid card right now. That is hot in tournament play. Jim, nice hit. Right off the get-go. All right, moving in, we have Temporal Forces, Ryan Tran. Out of Temporal, I think the Ghastly is the way to go. Either the Ghastly or... Maybe the... Oh, maybe the... God, I can't even think. I think we already pulled the alt art out of here, so I'm trying to think what other illustration rares we could get other than the Ghastly that would be really hot. I think Ghastly is the best one. The other one will pop in my head here shortly, but uh, Paradox Rift, Iron Hands, and the any of the Iron Hands. Andrew Kimberlin, you're up, and the um Roaring Moon are the ones to get. Oh, we got Gimmagool again. Nice. Solid opening here. Gimmagool again. Second time we pulled that, we pulled the Goldango. And that is uh Kimberlin. Now we have Shiny Ricardo. Temporal Forces. And let's see if we can let's see if we can get anything here. Carcoal, Grotal, Colossal, Perilous Jungle, Unpheasant, Melmetal, Solosis, and an Iron Valiant. So shiny Ricardo, we didn't get anything there. And then last but not least, Andrew Dolan, winner of the last one, you get Paradox Rift as well. You were going to be left out, but we didn't have enough people comment uh, who have commented multiple times. So basically, uh, you six are the OGs. Um, so congratulations, you six will be in the forever OG. Even if this ever gets big, I'm going to keep you guys involved. And you have a Galissapod, Dolan, nice. Awesome full art. Not sure if it's worth, worth a lot, but it's cool full art. All right, right back to you, Dolan. I think the Iron Hands is worth like $18, though, so I may be wrong about that, but uh, that Iron Hands is definitely worth quite a bit. So we got Dublade, Surskit, Magby, Countercatcher, Absol, Mela, Wimpod, nope. 
nothing there like I said I was able to get the roaring moon to work I ended up finishing in the master league and I'm also gonna try to get the uh, discord up here too if you guys want to play um, I'd be happy to play with you I haven't got that done yet I got a lot of things on the docket but just some of them haven't got there yet Shiny Ricardo right back to you though let's see here yeah, Mencino, love that card. Unculus, Mist Energy is great. Drillbur, great. Chatot, Mel Metal. That was actually a pretty solid uh, pack right there for building a bunch of different decks. Andrew Kimberlin, you are up. Magby, Vanillite, or Corio. We have Swablu, Turbo Jazz Energy. We have Blindside, Trubbish, Mantike, and Zekrom. All right. So let's see here. Moving back into Temporal, we have Ryan Tran. We're probably going to need a Ghastly based off that Iron Hands pull. Potential that we could get it. Um, got some shimmer there. I'm not sure if that's hollow shimmer or if it's better than hollow. We shall see. Let's hope it's the special illustration. Come on, show me. Uh, I think it's just the EX. Yep. Wug Trio trolled us with the shimmering sides. All right. We got a hit, though. We're on the board. And we're moving into Jim, who I think is in the lead with a standard EX, shockingly enough. But you need, like, four of those iron hands to work in the league play, and they're getting a lot of play. They pair up with the Iron Crown really well. Let's see if we can get anything else to match up with it. Evil, Zubat, and Latios. Back to Jason VT and Kip. Temporal Forces. Let's see what we can get. Looks like a hollow. Looks like a hollow, Jason. We're going to need something to pair with that Walking Wake. Do like the Reverse Coriodon. And Roaring Moon. A couple of playable cards right there. Moving into your last one, though, Jason. Let's see what we can do for you. I'm thinking we need out of Temporal for anybody to win is the Ghastly Illustration Rare. You won't really be able to tell if you get those. But we got an opportunity here. It has to be right here, though. Sent a scorch. Bramble gassed. Bummer. Bummer, bummer. Well, thank you for commenting as always, Jason. Appreciate it. Um, Jim, you are in the lead, I believe. Got Paradox here. A basic hit, I think, will put you in the lead. All right, so we are going to need something to put you further in the lead here. Uh, Hoopa EX, not really something that I was thinking was going to extend it, but it did look like there was something there. So Hoopa EX will help out, though. Um, Temporal Forces, we need the Ghastly. We already pulled the alt art from the box. And I didn't actually open up the boxes yet and mix the other ones in. I only opened up a few uh, sleeve boosters, so we're going to need an illustration rare. Sandy Shocks, it has to be right here. Rapidash. Not going to do it, and a Relicanth. But moving in, Andrew Kimberlin. See if you got anything 
We are going to need... I don't know what we would need out of, out of this set. Um, iron hands of some sort. Nope. Nope. Give me gold, nice hits, but not enough. So we still have Jim in the lead. Moving into Shiny Ricardo, Temporal Forces. Let's see what we got. Ooh, we got something. I do think we have a illustration rare. It looked like a different color there, so let's see if I'm right. Buddy Buddy Poffman, great card. Missed Energy Reverse, great card. Nope, I was wrong. Latias. And an Iron Thorns. Ah, oh, bummer. Bummer, bummer, bummer. All right. This is it. This is the last of the opportunities here. We have Andrew Dolan, Galispot EX versus Koopa and Iron Hands. And unfortunately, Iron Hands is extraordinarily playable. And Swing and Skedaddle is not. Kind of a weird, uh, weird Pokemon. Swing and Skedaddle. Um, do we have anything? I don't think so, but it would be illustration rare if we did. Paradox illustration rares would have to be Groudon. It's like a $30 card, so it's next up, $30 card. Let's see if we got it. Leopard and a Garchomp. Did not see that one. Garchomp EX. Awesome card. Wow. Solid card. Garchomp EX. I mean, if you go by just like card difficulties to get, you had a way better, a way better opening, Dolan. But unfortunately, I'm pretty sure this Iron Hands is worth more. I'll have the winners sit uh, listed below. Thank you guys for watching. Actually, a decent opening. I mean, out of everything, we had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven hits, which is pretty much what I want to see out of uh, half temporal forces. Normally, yeah, I would expect four out of nine or temporal. So, dude, I'm pretty pretty happy with that, especially because I think we got most of them out of paradox. Yeah, five out of paradox. So that's really good. Um, thank you guys again for watching. I'll see you on the next one.